So tell us what a machine le learning architect is, um, how that's different from machine learning engineering or data science. Yeah, fill us in. Yeah, so this is the first, me being a machine learning architect, this is the first role where I'm a machine learning architect. So my previous role was computer vision engineer or machine learning engineer. So how does, a mach how does the architect role differ from an engineering role? Well, as a machine learning architect, you got to start thinking on a system level. So you're thinking about other aspects of a machine learning systems that, that sort of integrate with the actual machine learning pipeline. So you're looking at the data engineering side, you're looking at the ML, ML ops side, and you're looking at the front end and the UI and considering all of those um, sort of components to the system architecture at a very high level and how that feeds into the machine learning component of the, of the system. Because now most modern application at the core is a machine learning component. So it's very crucial to have that machine learning person on your team that can actually understand the whole sort of how the whole infrastructure mm -hmm. and architecture works. So I'm very familiar with like a software architect role in general, who is being thoughtful about how the whole system works together. So would you often work alongside a software architect to figure out how the machine learning components in particular would uh, work smoothly inside of that? Good question. So because this is one sort of like my first time experience in this role, in this role, it's a, it's a learning journey for me. So right now I'm in a data engineering team. So I'm getting the, 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 right. the sort of the work before we get to the machine learning bit. I'm getting a perspective of that side and it's exciting, right? So working a lot with um, tools such as Databricks, um, using some streaming platforms, Kinesis, and just understanding that data journey, the data life cycle before it gets to that to the good stuff, which for us as machine learning folks is the features. But a lot happens to the data on a large scale project, on a large scale system before it gets to those to those feature sets. 